There's a lot of colors I don't know where to go See a lot of colors Only feeling blue There's a lot of colors Lost within a haze Don't rely on others To get you through Hi everyone this video is all about this tiny plug-in camera here. It's an infrared camera from Infraray. It's a T2 Pro and it plugs into a smartphone. Um, it can have a plug straight into the end of the smartphone or you can use a cable. And this handle and phone holder come with it. And as you can maybe see through that, it picks up heat sensor as you would expect for an infrared camera but I thought this would be really useful for checking out where your heat loss is on your van and it's really sensitive we've just drove up here to do this video and I can actually pick out the heat off my hand on the gear knob <laughs> and where I've been holding the steering wheel so it shows all the heat coming out all the heat vents but outside the van it shows where the heat is being lost out the camper van which I thought would be quite useful and uh, it's also useful for wildlife and I think you can actually get a mount to put it on a gun as well if you're into that sort of thing but it's got lots of different features on it and we've enjoyed playing with it um, we've got some great pictures of the whippets and Rosie's cold ears so it comes in this box nicely boxed and you get some instructions with it but it's really easy to use and the camera is actually tiny so in this quite a big box you get this lovely little padded case and inside here is the actual camera it's got a lightning connector on because i use an iphone and it's got a rubber cover over the lens and you don't want to be touching the lens and this rotates to focus it but all you have to do you don't even have to download the app the phone does it automatically fans of the app you plug it into there into your actual phone and away you go it can be plugged in either way and it instantly gives you infrared camera footage with all the settings on that um, you can adjust for different colors so you can have it in color setting or you can have it in black and white or other variations and it's even got a tracking mark on it as well so if you find something you can lock on it and it'll track it so if she was looking for wildlife or something you can lock on a particular heat source and follow that heat source along and it would track that piece of wildlife for you and you can take photographs and videos when it's actually running through your phone so here we are outside my van and as you can see there's some heat loss through the windows we don't have double glazed windows so that's good it, Joe's got the heater on in there so it's about 70 degrees and you can see where the, heng the engine's been running and it's warm so there's good insulation in this van this is the back so the top of the back doors in our van we have an outlet from our diesel heater into the garage which is underneath the bed and obviously some of the heat's sneaking out the top of there which is probably just the seal at the top but again very well insulated this is the other side just at the windows and you can see underneath there that's where the actual diesel heater is located in the wheel arch so AD who refitted my van has done a fantastic job on insulation well impressed with that super sensitive is this this is setting is on bed watching this one is rainbow this one is iron hot Sorry, Iron Rainbow. This one here is Red Hot. <laughs> because he's got cold ears. And then Black Hot. Got the diesel eater on, you can probably hear it. Switch between that one and a different colour. And then we have white hot. Joe's doing some admin. Is the end of your nose cold? It will be. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like you've got black teeth. 
So this is what it looks like on the screen. And these are the different settings that I've just been through. So the different color settings. And then you have all these, so you can change the, how bright and how, um, what configuration of colors you want. You've got your target, so you can lock it onto something. And then you've got a camera setting there as well. But if you actually scroll up, you get lots of different settings. You can set the temperature, so Fahrenheit or centigrade. It's got a, a speed tracker on it as well. So if you have it on a vehicle, you can set the speed. It's got all different bits and pieces that you can switch on and off. And so easy to use. You'd literally just plug it in and play. We're obviously using it during the daytime, but we will take it out on a night and have a play with it then. See how we get on. I also took the camera down to our local farm. It's lambing up where we are at the moment. And this is in the lambing shed where all the ewes are waiting to lamb and the lights are off here. So this is pitch black. And this is the heat sources from all the lamb, the sheep ready to lamb. Picks them out really well and it really is absolutely pitch black out there. So quite impressive, it picks up a lot of details. You can see a hell of a lot of details. You have to focus it for the different focal lens. So turning the end of the lens on the camera enables you to focus it. But it works really well. This is outside, there's a heat source there from a light. This is a different uh, variation of the colours. And then I took it across to have a look in the cattle shed and again this was completely black. So there's some sheep in the distance there and there's some cows but there was no lights on in here whatsoever. So pretty impressive really. Um, I'm really impressed how you can see the heat sources. This is a different variation of the colour back onto the camper van. Um, but I can guarantee now every time I go somewhere somebody's going to say have you got that camera with us can you uh, can you check out my heat losses here's a car going by which got up to about 50 meters away so it's got a good range on it so I've really enjoyed using this and it's uh, it's uh, an amazing piece of kit considering how small it is just that tiny little square camera and that as I say the focus to get the focal length you rotate the lens on the end and this housing this bracket and these attachments come with it obviously the phone doesn't come with it you have to use it on your phone um but brilliant piece of kit and i just know what's going to happen every time i bump into somebody if they've seen this video they're going to say have you got that thermal imaging camera can you scan me van for me and see if i've got any heat losses so it's a great way of testing out if you've got any losses of heat in your camper van your caravan or wherever and i suppose even in your house or, you know, if you're looking for some rodents in your garden or something, that might help you find it. Well impressed with it. So easy to use. You don't need the instructions. It's literally plug and play. And when I first plugged this into my phone, I didn't have to go to the app store. It just come up automatically and linked me to the app that would run the unit. The instructions and everything are really straightforward in the box. And it comes with all this bracketing, this handle the bracket to hold the actual camera and the unit to hold the phone. Didn't come with the lead, I put the lead on myself. Um, but yeah, good piece of kit. All the bracketing's aluminium actually and all adjustable, which is quite good. So as usual, I'll put all the information in the description below. We need to announce some giveaways. So the giveaways we're announcing in this video are the Energy QC. These are the three small power packs we recently did a review of and I'll put a card up here if you haven't seen that. And I, as usual, are filming this before the closing date. So we'll put the slides in of the three individual winners who've won these. And um, we'll put a message in the comments of this video to ask you to com contact us. And um, we'll communicate by email as usual on one man and his whippet at gmail.com. We'll get your delivery address and we'll send these out to you. The next giveaway is for the PowerNess solar panel and uh, the Paraness U500 Hiker, which uh, I recently did a video on. And if you haven't seen the video, we'll put it up here so you can have a look. We had great fun making this video, as you'll see. <laughs> and we got lots of comments saying, my God, is Joe safe up there? As we were filmed it in the snow and uh, it was a lovely day out, but it, <laughs> it was quite deep snow for them whippets and, and moving up the hillside. So again, we're filming this before the closing date. So we'll put a slide in now. And if this is you, um, you need to contact us through email at one man and his whip it dot com and we'll uh, communicate through that. We'll get your um, delivery information and we'll send that on to Chris at Powerness. 
And there was two things I forgot to mention in this video, and I think I did manage to mention it to everybody who entered. So if you're the winner, make sure that you've um, logged on to and subscribed to Power Ness's YouTube uh, site, because that was part of the remit, which I forgot to tell everybody. And I forgot to say, as well as the unit, you actually do get one of these sent from Power Ness as well, the actual solar panel that comes with it. I will try harder in future videos, honest. Thanks as everybody for watching. There is still another giveaway result to come out, but that's not until sometime in April. And that's for another power unit, the Vitoman one. And we'll deal with that later on in another video. But thanks for everybody again for tuning in and watching and subscribing. We've got a lot more videos to come and some more giveaways as well. See you on the next one. There's a lot of colours